The nervous system of the human body is responsible for sending, receiving, and processing nerve impulses. It controls the actions and sensations of all the parts of your body, as well as your thoughts, emotions, and memories. Of all the components of the nervous system, the brain is the primary component, occupying the cranial cavity. Without its outermost protective membrane, the dura mater, the brain weighs an average of three pounds, comprising 92% of the entire central nervous system. It is connected to the upper end of the spinal cord and is responsible for issuing nerve impulses, processing nerve impulse data, and engaging in the higher thought processes. The spinal cord serves as a sort of telegraph cable, which allows signals to be sent to and from the brain to the structures of the body and received from them in turn. The spinal cord is about a fourth of an inch in diameter and is slightly flattened. It passes through the vertebral canal created by the vertebral arches of the spinal column and sends out roots and branches much like a tree. These structures contain bundles of nerve fibers which extend all the way down the body, innervating even the skin of the tips of your toes. A single nerve fiber consists of a chain of neurons. Neurons are the basic cells of the nervous system. They are responsible for receiving and transmitting nerve impulses and forming long fibers by linking together. They consist of a cell body, which contains a nucleus with one or more axons and dendrites extending from the body. The dendrites are the multi-branch portions which receive impulses, while the axons are the elongated structures which carry impulses away from the body of the cell. Billions of neurons are located in the body's nervous system. They are so efficient that a nerve impulse, such as a pain impulse, can be transmitted from the hand to the brain and back again to allow a reflex movement in a fraction of a second.